Hi, I'm Chris with the Mobile Internet Info Center here today to talk to you and show off a brand new booster. This is uh, the CellFi Go M, brand new from Nextivity. And uh, this is a company that we've probably never heard of before because they haven't really been doing mobile boosters and this is their very first and we've got the very first one to go out. Um, and we're eager to check it out. So before I open this box up, what makes CellFi different is they have a digital booster technology that um, works kind of in cooperation with the cell carriers. So rather than just being a kind of a dumb analog booster that's just increasing whatever signal's coming into it, this actually works a little bit hand in hand with the carrier's network and only works with a single carrier at a time. So that's a downside that comes with the cell phone technology. You have to choose whether you're doing AT&T, T-Mobile, um, or Verizon. But the upside is because of their working in closer partnership with the carriers, they have permission and FCC certification to be a stronger booster. So this can go up to 65 decibels of boost versus 50 decibels being the legal limit for all other mobile boosters out there. So it's a very different kind of technology than any other mobile booster that we've checked out. And we're eager to see how it actually works in, in, in the field. Let's open it up and see what it looks like. Ooh, comes with a pen. Some documentation there. Documentation here. Documentation about the lights. This is a very small box. There we go. Here's how to install it in to a van. So the um LTE bands, this supports bands 2, 4, 5, 12, and 13. And a 12 is also band 17. So that's all the, the major important bands for, for boosting right now. Um, very similar to other boosters. But again, because you have to pick which carrier is being connected to, you're not actually using all the bands at once. Nope. Here's the booster itself. It is a very rugged metal box. The antenna port on one side and another for interior and exterior. And uh, power on the bottom. And yeah, this power is covered by a little waterproof seal. And this is actually a, a ruggedized um, booster. It's designed to, I don't think it's designed to be immersed, but it can be rained on and installed outside. So it's designed for, for uh, you know, doesn't need to be in a secure, dry environment, which is very different from some other boosters. Now you'll notice there's no switches or controls on this. You might be wondering how you change which carrier you're connected to and how it's working. And that is actually done via an iPhone and I believe Android app that talks to this over Bluetooth and is the control panel. That also gives you a view of signal strength, which would be really nice to actually see what the different bands are. So, I think this looks like it's a power cable. Yep, so 12 volt power cable, and this actually is the kind of connection that will screw on to be secure. Yeah. Okay, so that comes off. This will actually screw to attach so it won't accidentally detach. It's, that's pretty impressive. Nice rugged design. Okay, there's that, that. What else do we got? Looks like we've got some uh, mounting screws if you want to bolt that to a wall. It's got little standoffs to attach that to a wall. Down under here, some antennas. Now the indoor antenna here, small little basic candy bar patch antenna, very similar to a lot of other boosters. Uh, theoretically, this should give us more indoor range than um, a lot of mobile boosters because of the different kind of technology they're using. 
um, we're eager to see if that actually pans out. And here's the outdoor antenna. So mag mount, looks probably around 10 to 15 feet of cable. I'll have to double check exactly how much cable and then very short antenna here, very low profile. Screw this on. And there's your outside antenna. So this is the CellFi kit. We are going to be installing this later this week and uh, testing it head to head against uh, a whole range of other boosters, including the um, latest from uh, WeBoost, the latest from SureCall, and is there any other boosters? Smooth and the Smooth Talker. So we're gonna be uh, encrusting our RV with some uh, uh, boosters soon and uh, trying these out in a range of low signal locations. We are particularly excited to see what the self I can do because this is just a different kind of booster than the rest. Um, it's been out for residential use for a while. This is their very, very first mobile device. So there we go, the Selfi uh, Go M by Nextivity.